Yes guys, the version 13.12 update has just rolled out and my gosh, this one has been huge. We've got new things in the game such as a new flare gun, we've got new LTMs coming, loads and loads of new cosmetics. We've also had a huge update to save the world which could mean that you guys could get 8,000 V-Bucks completely, completely for free. More bundles, a map change and guys, the introduction to vehicles can be very soon in Fortnite due to these leaks. Yo guys, what is going on? Bubbles here. Yes, that's right. Huge, huge update today and I'm obviously here to bring you guys all of the latest Fortnite news leaks and updates. So if you do indeed go on to find this video useful and informative, make sure you smash that thumbs up button. Make sure you obviously subscribe to me here on the channel to stay up to date with everything Fortnite related. And guys, make sure you are indeed using someone's creator code in the Fortnite item shop. And if you do need one to help support your girl that one step further, it is indeed code Bubbles. Hashtag ad, hashtag epic partner. Let's get straight into this update though guys. First of all I want to take the time to talk about Save the World. Now there was an absolute huge blog written about this. I read through the whole thing. I'm not going to read through the whole thing now. I'm just going to highlight the things that a Battle Royale player will be actually benefited from or will be like involved in for say. Since I know quite a lot of you guys don't have Save the World but if you do I will leave a link to that post down in the description below. Check it out. It is actually really interesting. Now a lot of big Save the World players are actually staying how this is like a big rip it's not a good update in the slightest I when I read it thought it was a great thing but I guess I don't really play save the world that that much so that's why I believe that this is a good thing but basically what's happening is it's been confirmed it is not free but it is however out of the developer sort of stage in which it's kind of like the beta I would say it's been in beta for like three years now and it's out of that stage is the official release now and basically what that means is that all of the paid funders will have their founders packs upgraded to the next level and unlock all rewards included the upgraded pack free courtesy of home base ultimate edition owners will be granted the new metal team leader pack and 8,000 v bucks that is insane 8,000 free v bucks if you have the ultimate edition of save the world crazy and you probably heard in there the metal team leader pack yes that's right the metal team leader pack is going to be a save the world pack you can purchase it for around 20 dollars in game and you basically get this skin you get a bunch of different stuff for save the world however the skin the metal team leader does indeed roll through to battle royale also so arguably going to be a pretty rare skin I would say because obviously not only do you have to own Save the World, you then got to put $20 on the line for that bundle as well. But yeah, definitely really awesome. Definitely a cool pack. I think it's a positive thing. Let me know what you guys think of this change and all of that kind of stuff down in the comments below though. But yeah, very huge. Save the World is not going to be three and yeah big changes coming but regarding battle royale what have we got well some new gameplay tags were actually added and some of these are very exciting indeed first of all refill vehicle that obviously regarding refueling it i take it then we've got force end snapped grappling gun consumable traveler defend traveler attack definitely some pretty cool ones there a lot of things that could be added to regard those things such as vehicles obviously something to do with the grappling gun and honestly just a bunch of different stuff regarding obviously the traveler whole thing so yeah i don't want to go into too much detail because obviously at the moment it's kind of just theories about all of those things but they've been added very cool indeed what else has changed the map the map the water levels have started to lower guys it is indeed a little bit lower we've got a bit more land here there and everywhere the little fishy island just south of steamy stacks the water is now lowered there so there is no longer the fishy little island there's a bit more land in the center of the map and this is probably going to be a reoccurring thing every two weeks for the water level to go down more and more so pretty cool the start of something big here what else has happened ltms are indeed going to be coming back fortnite sent out an email to all creators i received this and they basically said the ltms are going to start to be rolling in again in season three finally i'm so happy about this i was literally talking to mate yesterday about how LTMs need to be come back because they're just fun and we need these easy, light-hearted game modes in the games. It's not just all sweaty. So this is a great thing. I'm really happy. And also, there was a new LTM that's been added and it's called Chrome. And what Chrome is, is it's going to be a fully racing LTM, 
which is insane. Obviously means we've got to wait, obviously, for the cars to come in the game for this LTM, but it shouldn't be too long. Most likely by the end of the season, obviously, we will be getting this LTM and cars and all of that awesome stuff. Next up, what have we got? Floppers also have been upgraded in this update, and they're now Floppers Mark II. Basically, what's happened is they've got a whole new texture to them, so they might look different when you actually find them in-game, but they're still the good old floppers that we know and love. Next up, what have we got? A new POI has also been added, guys. This is really damn cool. This POI is indeed codenamed as Volcano. So we've obviously been there, done that, and we might be doing it all over again. Volcano got added in the old chapter of Fortnite and I absolutely loved it. I really, really liked that part of the map. And it looks like potentially we could be getting another volcano as it has literally been added into the files of the game. Now, I don't know if you guys know, but if a volcano erupts, when the lava actually reaches water, it actually creates land. So what I think could be really cool is if some kind of volcano forms, maybe in the part of the map um, where there's that whole void that people are saying Atlantis is going to come, maybe there could be a volcano there, it kind of erupts. The lava obviously then reaches the water and creates a new island or something like that. That would be pretty cool. Let me know what you guys think about that little theory that I made there. Because I think that's definitely really, really sick. But next up, what have we got? This is a big one, guys. Captain America. Yes, that's right, guys. We 99.9% .9 chance are going to be getting Captain America in the next week in the item shop. So also in the little email that Epic sent out to creators, they did actually say a mighty arrival is coming to the item shop this week. Stay tuned. And then what have we found in the files of Fortnite is indeed this image here, which quite clearly is Captain America. Obviously, next week is going to include the 4th of July in it. So obviously, the 4th of July being a very large America Day, Captain America, you know, it all adds up. It makes sense. Captain America in the item shop next week? Most likely, definitely exciting, definitely should be using code bubbles to purchase him. And also talking of Marvel skins, we're also getting kind of a Thor skin as well. And in the sense of that, it is indeed through this skin here, Dad Bod Jonesy. Now, if you ask me, that is literally Fat Thor from Endgame. Literally couldn't be any other skin that would look more like Thor in my eyes. But yeah, definitely awesome there. Captain America and Thor in the same week. Pretty cool indeed. And I definitely look forward to next week's item shop. Next up, what have we got regarding V-Bucks here? We soon will be able to reload V-Bucks. Which, if you didn't know, what it basically means is that if, say, you have 200 V-Bucks and a skin that you want is 800 V-Bucks, you will not have to keep on purchasing the 1,000 V-Buck bundle or more. You will be able to actually purchase the exact amount of V-Bucks that you need. So this basically means that it will be less money and you just have to pay for the V-Bucks required, which is an awesome, awesome change. And definitely excited for when that to actually be a thing as people can start to, you know, just use their money more wisely with V-Bucks, I guess. Next up, what have we got? The new item that has come out today it is indeed flare guns. Now, at the current time I'm recording this, the game is still in downtime. So no one is obviously able to get in the game. No one can try out. So we don't fully know what they're like but I'm sure by the time you're watching this video the game should most likely be up so you can try it out for yourself but regarding it what have we got about this flare gun damage is 60 to players the fire rate is 0 0.6 it's got a clip size of 6 and its reload time is 1.5 seconds so it sounds pretty decent I believe it's going to be something like the flint knock but again obviously it could be false with that statement apparently it's meant to actually light things on fire things being structures and wood so that's really cool definitely excited to see the fly gun in action if it's going to be shooting builds down essentially by burning them i think that would be pretty damn cool now next up what have we got the double agent bundle i made a video of this yesterday basically talking about everything so go check that out if you want to know anything regarding that it's now been official with the actual title though it's called the double agent bundle and it's now officially got these two images here obviously highlighting the amazing skins and also the fact that it's got pickaxes with it pretty damn awesome the golden chaos scythe i think it's called it's absolutely phenomenal looking one of my favorite pickaxes as it is and now 
the golden star with it is gorgeous really super like that and moving on now guys we've got vehicles now vehicles we obviously know are going to be coming to the game i've already leaked how there's four different vehicles coming and we have more information about these four vehicles today and that is because posters are going to be rolling around the map and you will indeed see these vehicles highlighted on these posters we've got the first one bear which is showing us a pickup truck that we will be getting we've got mud flat which is a big huge truck pretty damn cool and beasty looking we've then got prevalent i hope i've said that right it's some sort of car you know an average car pretty nice and then we've also got whiplash which is indeed our sports car very sick really like that and i'm really excited to use the sports car this whiplash in the game probably within the next few weeks i want to say when the water levels do go down more and then finally, just to finish this off, guys, I want to show you guys all of the leaked skins that we're going to be getting here on this image. As we can see, there's all of the cosmetics there as well. Some really, really cool skins here. I know a lot of you guys like seeing all of these leaked skins, so there you guys go. Enjoy. Pause the video and check them out. But that is indeed everything today for this 13.20 update. Very excited, a very good update in my opinion. I love these kind of huge updates and it's definitely healthy for Fortnite to keep rolling out big updates like this every two weeks, I would say. Every fortnight, literally. So yeah, that is indeed it. Smash a like on the video if you have indeed enjoyed. Subscribe to me here on this channel, obviously, to stay up to date with all the latest Fortnite news leaks and updates. And finally, guys, if you do indeed want to help support your girl that one step further, make sure you do indeed use creator code BOBBLES in the Fortnite item shop, especially when purchasing Captain America next week. But anyway, guys, thank you all. Much love and I will We'll see you all in the next video. Bye, guys.